Warning! This episode is probably not going to be view appropriate for all viewers because of a language. Hi everybody, welcome back to some more news. No. Super Mario Galaxy 2. I knew I was going to do it at third time. I knew I was going to do it at third time. It's weird because it's been a long time since I said new Super Mario Bros. And right now, episode 41, probably the last episode I'm filming today, I say it. Here we have Flip Out Galaxy. This is not the part that you're going to have any problems with. It's when we get to the speed run. This is probably going to be a double length episode. Wicked wall jumps. I'm telling you that because I took 45 minutes for me to do it the first time I did it. So that's just a crazy. Yeah, so anyways. So mainly, um, do that. I mean, right now it's simple. So it's just like the tin. So be careful with your shakes. Okay, yeah. So you have to. Oh, there's a platform on it though. We'll take it. It's not too difficult. Like once you figure out everything you gotta do, it's not too hard. But yeah, I'm ashamed of the language tin because I have a feeling that that speed run is just gonna be. And Mario didn't make it. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to s do a long jump and then spin. i probably try that. That usually works, because it gives you a little extra boost. So we'll, we'll try to do it like that. Because, you know, you go, oh. And s how did I even do that? Like, it doesn't make any sense. I maybe hit the spike guy, but I don't I don't think I hit him. I think it's like I bumped into the wall or some shit like that. I guess it's possible I bumped into the wall, but I mean I'm really close to the wall, so it might make sense that I do that. But like look, okay, I'm gonna stay right here. Maybe because I don't need Yeah, I did that's what you gotta do. That walking up here, got a checkpoint. At least the prankster comment here, which is gonna come after die, you asshole. And I died. It's actually a pretty difficult one, but not too bad. I just have three lives. How do I have three lives? Oh yeah, I died so many times at Stone Canyon or Stone whatever. You are not supposed to come down! And I died again. I try to go through all of them, but it's really hard. Because you want to do that, you're gonna... No, you're gonna fall down right away. You're not gonna stay floating like your friends. Okay, this is easy to do that. Oh, come on, seriously, game? Tis, I take so freaking long to do that. You almost surely get hit by one tin. You know, and we have to go get the Comet Meadow too, so that's what I'm trying to do now. Make sure this is out. No, you probably need to not make sure it's not up, so you could do a...
open jump to get on it. And with just one life left, I don't think... I could surprise you. Is that you really don't have much time because look at that. Okay. Yeah, okay, we got that. Thankfully, I made it. Oh man, I don't, I can't believe I actually passed through that. Okay, now all we have to do is do a few more wicked wall jumps. No! What the hell? I was at the end and I just bump into the wall and fall down! What the hell? That is just bullshit. This game. What the heck was that? Seriously. Okay, you you just shut up, okay, fat guy. You're just sitting there doing absolutely nothing. He's probably gonna give me a letter from Princess Peach. So, Peach gets me five one ups, so. I don't know if five one ups are gonna be enough to do that one. Oh, yeah, by the way, they always make you start outside here, so you have to go through absolutely everything. You know, especially how weird this world is. They couldn't make something like to get you faster to this area, like, you know, after you beat Boss Blizz, you know, they didn't think about that, I don't know. But yeah, that last one, those last two were like bullshit deaths. You cannot tell me that I really deserve those deaths. Especially that last one, I need to do one last freaking wall jump, and after Mario just hits the wall, like, hey, I don't want to jump this time. And it's like so stupid. Anyways, so I have to do these, this again. Okay. So that's in. I'm gonna grab some of these because we had a nice amount of star bits actually. Probably because they died so many times. There too. I hit the wall. I don't know how. Okay. What the hell? I didn't even move my control stick or control with it. We remote. I don't know what it's called. I can't control her still. But what the hell? I didn't even move it. So you see, that's like three deaths in this area, back to back to back, that I didn't even really deserve, because I didn't even do anything. Especially that last one, like, why did Mario just randomly shake? Okay, there I hit the wall, but... Wasn't too bad. Okay, we're back here, finally. Who cares, I'm gonna go for it. Look, by the time I'm moving, they're already coming out with the spikes. Okay, this time I'm, I, I'm gonna get it. Okay. Need that. You 
already just make it. You know what? It's okay. I don't need lives. I don't need health, I mean. There's no more spikes or anything to give Mario harm, except falling into a bottomless pit by something that you... Ah! No, come on! Come on! You see how bullshit that was? Seriously! Seriously! Asshole spiders, I'll just kill them. Calling yourself the other one. Seriously. That last one. Come on. Like, how was that fair? has a tendency to go outwards when he does wall jumps. Okay, now this somehow screwed me last time. See, I made it. And the last time when I did exactly that, for some reason, for some reason, I hit the wall and went falling down to my debt and I couldn't do anything because Mario got hit in the head by the wall. See, this was long enough to be its own episode. It's like so stupid. I mean, it's like just all freaking old time doing this stupid star that probably shouldn't have taken that long in the first place. You see, it says 4 minutes 20 seconds. It's actually 12 minutes because I died, so that's why it doesn't, they don't know. You know. And now, it's just... No. I still don't want to do that one, but I'm going to do, do it right now. So, I'm just saying this is the last episode. Probably, may, maybe I'll do the, I'll maybe do the Destin, that one's prankster, depending on how I feel here. But it'll probably be the next episode. This is just the worst of the worst. It took me 45 minutes to do this speed run in my first playthrough. 45 minutes. I just stuck at these bosses. I can't speedrun bosses. It's just not. It's just not like you know. Like the first time I did it, I, it took me seven minutes to do it, and I didn't die. So I know that it took me actually seven minutes, five minutes, and there's no freaking clocks here. Thankfully, they they, they don't put the timer in your in these scenes right in after. I would up. But okay. This guy, I'm going to say, he's not hard, even when you do him, even when you have speed run with him, he's not too hard. Look, okay, he's already dead. Okay, one down. I really wish they won't give you these, make you see these scenes, because they're really annoying, but one down. Now let's get here. This is about the time you'll want to be. This is well, for me. This guy takes a lot of time. Not, not a lot. I forgot about that. You want to be here so that you could get the most out of your time. Jump over that. Oops, I forgot that it was... I forgot that it was... Um, that that was what it was. Um, just use the blue ones, that takes time. So yeah, that's what you kind of want to do. You want to kind of be around this time. I mean, technically speaking, you'll be around that time. You could go get the red mushroom, I don't know if it's there. But, I don't, because I need all the time, I, I need so much time with this asshole. Um, so yeah. Okay, 
The first hit is easy. No, he's like, oh, I hit you, but I'm trying to kill you, but you can't hit me. Okay, he's coming from there. Okay, I was able to hit him pretty fast. Now it's just really this one. I would say you can only get one hit on this boss to have the chance to actually beat this. Okay, he's gonna come like a maniac. Surprisingly, I did it really good this time. Sometimes it's like that. Die, please. I'm right next to it. I still didn't take one point of damage somehow, but whatever. Now, Boulder guys, we have lots of time, but he's gonna drain it like you've never seen been drained before. Okay. Come on, Boulder guys. Seriously, you're just shooting one rock? You asshole! See, that's what I'm telling you! How is that fair? That just drained a bunch of time! And they tell me, you just have two minutes left, but oh yeah, Boulder guys, um. See, again, he's just shooting one! At least this. Come on, game! There was a boo, and you just. You just made it not appear! He just blew up! Grab that. Oh, I need some older guys. Okay. Now, how much time do I have left? I have to beat this one, and I have to beat the Fire Piranha. And he has his hands. So, like, I don't know how this is freaking fair, but it, they're, they're telling me it's fair. See, he's draining time. I'm gonna need at least one minute. See, it just broke up! And look! I can't do anything about it! I can't do anything about it, because his hands didn't even do the same moves as last time, which I could have maybe... See, his other hand was in the way this time! You see? And now he's doing this stupid tin. He just drained my time, and I didn't hit him once! Look, he's just punching! What is that gonna do to help me? That's what I freaking hate about this. He takes freaking forever, and you can't do anything. I somehow got to him twice. Now he's wasting my time again. That's why I say I hate Boulder guys, because he takes freaking forever. Now, if I could just get that one boo. Somehow beat at him. I have just a bit over one minute left. He's wait. Oh, he, he, it, my, at least my timer's not going. But I have just a little over a minute. I have to walk also, and this of course takes time. So I literally have 59 seconds to beat this boss. 59 seconds. Come on, you asshole! Freaking piece of crap! The easiest hit! I still have to hit him! I still have to hit him three times, and I have two health. See? Okay, one hit! One hit! Two hits left! Two hits left! Oh my god! One hit left! One hit left! Oh my god. Am I gonna be able to... Oh my god! I beat it on my first try! Are you serious? My heart's beating so fast, I can't freaking believe this. I don't even really know how much time I had left on the timer. 
Oh my god. That's like probably the hardest star in the game or the second hardest because the perfect run is really hard but I never really felt mad or frustrated at it. Like I just kept trying it but this time I was like going crazy. I went pretty crazy there too but I mean come on. It deserved it. You saw some of that stuff. That boulder guys it just drains your time. <sighs> well it's 20 minutes. I'll, I'll try and do the flip out just so that'll be done and I could do the bouncer off screen So yeah, um So Really what it is is Okay, this is cosmic clones Cosmic clone wall jumpers is Know what I'm talking about? It's the I think it's it's exactly the same. Just that you have cosmic clones. They're not in this section, so you have a bit of a section to rest. But yeah, um, I'm just gonna tell you, you after this, and you have all. They, they're telling you how to do this at this point in the game. Like you know, do we really need that? This is where they're gonna appear. Oh, and they don't give you a moment to rest. They appear like now. Um, so after you do this, uh, Cosmic Cones also go through walls. You don't have much time to rest, because you have Cosmic Clones. And look at that bullshit crap! Like seriously! Anyways, um... After you do this star and you get the 120th star, you have to go back. You have to go back and beat Bouncer again in his Bouncer generator. So you have to do the whole level again, beat Bouncer again. To do all that again, and then after you have to watch the credits again, watch the boring crap cinema. Okay. Come on! Seriously? Okay, yeah. So you have to watch the boring cinema, boring credits again, and then after there'll be this just one little scene of like Rosalina, and it's like her like read into the little Zumas or something like that. That freaking crap. See, I, you can't jump there. That's what I'm trying to tell you. I was able to do it somehow in my original file. Anyways, though baby Luma that's with Mario is going to appear out of nowhere. He's going to say he wants to hear a story or something like that. Or Rosalina says she's going to read him a story. Come on. Come on, you freaking Mario! Just stood there and did nothing when I was shaking my Wii remote. Sorry if I'm screaming, it's just I'm mad because I'm doing the stuff and Mario's just not doing it. And it's always that thing when you get to this part of the game. Well, I'm saying that, but I mean... Okay... See ya. That's where I, that's what you just do long jumps. Make your life easier. Uh, I freaking had to do that. I I had no choice! I was gonna fall! If I fell I was gonna die, if I did die I was gonna die. So in other words I was gonna die no matter what. You see that's what happens with these cosmic clones since they make you rush. Cause you have no choice, you gotta rush because you have stupid cosmic clones on your tail. But then after you rush so much that you're gonna end up getting killed. See ya! What how is fair is that? I have to do the wall jump to get up, but a cosmic clone comes right when I'm jumping up. You see, that's what you, you can't... You see, that's why I, I can't stand about this one. 
I have to wait till perfectly till this goes up down so I could have enough time to do this and and I see last time it went perfectly fine and this time it doesn't work so you know try to figure out how you're supposed to do a strategy if every time you play it it's not gonna happen exactly the same way your strategy is based perfectly on that it's gonna work like the other times but it's not And you think I'm far enough ahead of this cosmic clone, but no, I'm not. And what the hell was that? I did a spin and I didn't even reach the tin. You see, like, it's all different every time I'm doing it. So if every time I do it and it's different, how am I supposed to, to do the level and beat it if every time my strategies are not going to work because you just decide you're going to not do it the same way? I mean, I understand if I'm taking longer or something to get to a place, things are gonna move on. Like, you know. See? Right where I was! That is just bullshit! Why does it have to be right where I am, right when I'm doing it? Not one second earlier or one second later, right when I'm there. See, that's what I can't stand about that one. Mm, I have to do this. Click that. Take the whole route around. Sorry if I'm just acting like crazy now, but it's just that, like, I just can't stand it. Like, when every time I'm doing it, it's completely different. So sometimes I'm doing a tin, it works. And then, oh, um, next time it's not gonna work. Why is it not working this time when I'm doing it exactly the same way at the exact same time? It should work. So, other than these crap ones of this wall jump, I was actually pretty decent in, like, all those hard ones that I can't stand. Like, the chimp challenges, the score challenges of the chimp. I think I got them, like, on my second try or something like that. I got the freaking speedrun of my most feared star in Mario Galaxy 2 on my first try. I don't know how I did that. Oh, not this time. You're not getting me this time. Freaking cosmic clones. Okay, we have to do that. Uh, that guy, that fat guy is in the way. Yeah. See, that's like something like that I would understand. Like, okay, he's not at the same place because he's moving. So, naturally, if you're faster this time, you're not going to be there at the same time as him. The spikes, though, should be pretty. Like, should. Like, be at the same point in time. Like, you know. You know, so, yeah. Okay, well, I've been pretty good now. Okay, we're here. Asshole. So, like, I have to walk here. Because I have to start running right now. To make sure I make it. Uh, I should make it this time. I think I'm gonna make it. Okay, good. Uh, I almost got hit by that tin, but I didn't, so... That's the important tin. Okay. See? Again! And I even took time to slide down a bit so that I could start jumping later. He still comes in right at the same time like he always does. And I, there's nothing I could do about it. There's just nothing I could do about it. I know what I know what I did last time and I'm trying to do it and it's just not working. Okay, we do this. Now, nah, at least we can make it always here, usually. Usually. Okay. See? Another one hits me! I made it past him, but another one came right where I was. It's just... You, you know, how am I supposed to beat that when actually I pass him because I weighed it? But, you know, whoa, another one's gonna come. 
And why is it always the blue is open now? It wasn't like that last time. So anyways, I don't know, but whatever. Okay, like that. Okay, I don't know why, but anyways. See that I got it this time. See, and what did I do different this time? Freaking nothing. I did just the same. I just let myself fall down a bit longer, and that's like what? So you say I slide down for like two, one second longer, and or one or two seconds longer, and it makes me like not hit them. But another time I did that, and I hit it them. So you know, like I don't get that. You know. This time I did it, I missed, I didn't touch the Cosmic Clones. Last time I did it, but the Cosmic Clones touched me, so like, I don't know. Anyways, what, 120 stars? The episode's gonna end here. Wait, this, this guy has to talk to me. Whoa, another green one! Those are really rare, am I? And I'm just speechless! Wow, nice work! Which one's the new one? I guess that one? Looks like he has something he needs to tell you about. Well, I guess we can make this last one minute longer. Now, where was the green one? Let me guess. I'm gonna go this way. There, there they are. Wait, where is he? It must be this way. Why can't I never find the green ones? Last time I went the other way and I didn't find them. And this time I go this way and I don't find them. Even if we have every power star, you still must defeat that monster or we'll never see the cosmic jewels. Mostly saying, okay, you have all 120 stars, go beat Bouncer again. Yeah, I know. That's your reward. Okay. Anyways. Next time, we'll be going for the green stars. I'm just going to beat Bouncer off screen so you don't have to look at that again and look at all the credits. The only thing you're not going to see is the Rosalina part. So, in other words, the Luma that's with Mario now, he's going to come in the room with Mario's hat because he steals it and Rosalina's gonna like read a story about the cosmic jewels which are the green stars and then after it's just gonna tell you that you could find green stars in each level so it's kind of anticlimactic in that way but yeah so anyways we'll do that next time I'll see you then taking that Mario you did